Hey guys, what's up? So, in this video I'm going to go and spend an hour killing skeletal wyverns, and um, I want to kind of see what I can get out of them. I went and killed them for like 20 or 30 minutes uh, a couple days ago when they were updated, and it wasn't really a very consi like a consistent test, and I didn't really time it, I didn't keep track of how many I killed or anything like that. So this one I'm going to be a bit more uh, consistent about it and make it actually like statistically good. And um, this is the gear setup I'm using right now. It's actually probably the best setup I can use. It has plus 405 range defense, and then I'm going to be praying, me uh, praying melee. And uh, it actually has higher range defense than a Barrow set does, which is kind of interesting. But I have the Varox helm on for a bit extra defense and the prayer bonus. And then I'm using the Hosta because they're weak to crush. I have the DFS because you need it for um, protecting against their ice fire stuff and then the rest is sort of obvious. I could be using a uh, tyrannical ring which has the plus 8 crush if you imbue it which would be a bit better but can't really be bothered to go buy one and then have to do a bunch of nightmare zone to imbue it and stuff like that. And I kind of doubt I would ever use it for anything else because Zerka ring is probably better for any task where I'd need to use a hosta for crush which I don't know if there actually are any that are worth doing. But anyways this is my inventory setup. I have a dragon mace because that's pretty much the only spec weapon that would be worth using because they are weak to crush and they have a very high defense to anything else. DDS might be good, but D-Mace is the only spec weapon that has crush, I think, that is one-handed. So I uh, can't use SGS because if you take off the DFS, you get pounded for like 40s and stats are drained and stuff, so that's really bad. And then I have uh, Brew, Restore, Attack, and uh, Strength Pots. And I, use, I bring the Brew just for a bit of extra health and also for the defense. And then the Restore, of course. And then the rest is just Sharks. I have Lunar Staff because that's the easiest way to get to... Um, the area where they are. So I'm going to head over there now and I'm going to go spend an hour killing them and see what I can get out of it. Alright, so in total from two trips of uh, killing skeletal wyverns, which was just an hour exactly, I finished the second trip just as the uh, minute mark came up. Um, this is the loot that I managed to get, which is really, really good. Um, the, at the bottom are the supplies that I used up, and I ended up using eight prayer potions, but I got um, 14 as drops, so in total I got six, like I net profited six prayer potions, um, which I added into the calculations. But, anyways, the total loot without removing the cost of supplies was about 1 mil and if I remove the cost of supplies it was about 175k which brings it down to about 825k in an hour. Um, so a few things to keep in mind with this figure um, this is just one hour if I did 10 hours it would be a bit more uh, consistent for a, a real like hourly how much you would make 
but also I did not get any drops of Renar seeds and these things can drop three Renar seeds which is about 100k loot right there so if I got one of those that would have added a lot to the total value and uh, a day or two ago I healed them for like 20 to 30 minutes and I got three drops of three Renar seeds so that was like almost 300k so it can definitely skew the results a lot since I didn't get those it's gonna be a bit lower than the average probably and I also did not get any granite legs which are anywhere from 200 to 400k and they're the unique drop of skeletal wyverns 1 in 512 drop and I also did not get a dragon leg or plate skirt drop which is a new drop that they have which are anywhere from like 200k or so around there so if I gotten any of those drops my total value would have been up a bit but I would say on average you probably can profit around a mil per hour here using the gear that I'm using and everything and if you have higher combat stats than me then maybe a bit higher even um, you can also range them and just pray range and you will take hardly any damage if I think you can actually do it without taking any damage if you just leave your range prayer on um, but it will be significantly slower kills and probably not worth it if you have decent combat stats um, another thing that I did not uh, take into account or try doing is cannoning there it definitely will be possible to cannon there and it might actually be worth it for making faster GP per hour it could bring the total up to like 1.2 1.5 mil per hour which is really really good so Skeletal Wyverns are definitely a good way to make money if you want to be doing some combat while making money and sort of more along the lines of like Frost Dragons rather than actually bossing, just sort of killing somewhat high level monsters and banking and stuff. So um, they're really really actually quite good and I'm really glad that they decided to buff these and you can get them as a Slayer task but they are quite uncommon to get a Slayer task which is kind of odd but if you do happen to get a Skeletal Wyvern task might actually be worth doing now since the drops are quite good. But yeah, I guess that's about it for this video, guys. Hopefully you have enjoyed it. Uh, make sure to leave a like if you enjoyed and subscribe if you want to see more videos. I may or may not make more videos like this anytime soon. It just depends whether I decide to find anything interesting to kill, but most people, most monsters have already been killed by a lot of people and made videos about and everything like that. But once I start doing Slayer in a few months, whenever I start Slaying, then I might make some more videos trying to do like loot-based stuff, because I know people find it interesting, and I definitely do. Um, but that's going to be all. Thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you guys soon with a new video.